This is Tom Dillon, the Lifetime Liberal, and today is Friday, June 15th, 2018. The title of this rant is Institutionalized Child Abuse. There can be no other description of what is going on at our southern border. So we saw in the last couple days, and there was a report on MSNBC yesterday, uh, that we know that this administration, the purveyor of evil, no other term but that, is taking children away from their parents at the border and sending them to separate facilities. They showed one on MSNBC yesterday, uh, little boys aged 10 to 17, uh, they're being uh, uh, herded into a old Walmart uh, where they must be inside the building 22 hours per day, ha can go outside for two hours, they can't leave, they're stuck there, uh, they don't, we don't know how much access they have. MSNBC couldn't bring any, any, any uh, camera equipment in there, so we only got to see pictures that were given to us, you know, by uh, HHS or Border Patrol or whatever. And of course, uh, Jeff Sessions is saying, this is the law, and we are just enforcing the law. And of course now, there are so many children that have been taken away from their parents, they're talking about building tent cities uh, for them because they don't have the space available right now. Now the law, and this is really is what gets my gourd, is the law that they are citing has been on the books for about 10 years. It doesn't say anything remotely about that at all. It's not what the Bush administration saw in the law. It's not what the Obama administration saw in the law because they did nothing like this. It is basically this administration's interpretation of the law, which they enacted into a policy, and this policy can be, re can be rescinded at any moment, at any time. And going out there and blaming the Democrats who can't even bring a bill to the floor, <laughs> uh, and saying it's their fault is a lie on top of a lie. Now, as I said, Jeff Sessions said, oh, well, this is in the Bible. And he, he cited a Romans 13 uh, from Paul, the Apostle Paul. And of course, we know that that was used previously a couple times. One of those times was basically during slavery where white pastors in the South used that, <laughs> saying that it's in the law that uh, slavery was okay. That's what they're basing it on. And of course, there's dozens of other things that do not talk about that, but bringing in immigrants, taking them into your home, showing hospitality, hospitality, hospitality towards them. And the biggest one is the one that we all learned, which was the Good Samaritan. Okay, so let's get this down. This has been done strictly by racism, by white dominion, dominionism, and by white privilege because they want to hurt people who are not the same as them. And every single woman should not vote for any Republican ever in any election, especially this upcoming one, because we have not heard a peep out of a single Republican in reference to all of this. You know, they're all, they don't have nothing to say about it. And I just quote the Washington Post at the end where they basically said that everything that this administration has said about taking children from their parents and everything that they've done about it is violently divorced from reality. These people are scum and we need to get rid of them.